Hello and welcome back. In today's Black XLS presentation, we will highlight the 10 most successful Black American idols. Welcome to BlackExcellence.com, the site where we share Black excellence, opulence, and affluence. Our mission is to inspire you as we enlighten you. American Idol is an American singing competition television series that began airing on Fox in 2002. The show has become one of the most successful shows in the history of American television. The concept of the series involves discovering recording stars from unsigned singing talents, with the winner determined by the viewers. This mainstay of American television was hybrid reality show and talent search competition. We are taking a look back at some of the most memorable black contestants and find out about some of their recent accomplishments. Each of these contestants were unique. Diehards were excited to see the raw talent of African-American artists like Jennifer Hudson, Ruben Studdard, and Fantasia Barino grace the American Idol stage. These black competitors have successfully leveraged the American Idol stage into a successful launching pad to everything from Platinum Awards, Grammy Awards, Broadway runs to Academy Awards. In this Black XLS video, we will be featuring the 10 most successful black American idols. So without further ado, let's get started. Number 10, Tamara Monica Gray. Tamara Gray finished fourth place on the first season of American Idol in 2002. Record and television executive Simon Cowell was disappointed when she was voted off and felt she could have won. Post-American Idol, Gray's first solo album, The Dreamer, which Gray wrote herself, was released in May 2004. Gray has performed on both Broadway and in television. She had a recurring role on the third season of the drama series Boston Public in early 2003. Number 9. Latoya Renee London Latoya London was the fourth place finalist on the third season of American Idol. Her debut album, Love and Life, was released in September 2005 and spawned a number of moderate R&B chart hits. Since then, she performed in the award-nominated national tour of the Broadway musical The Color Purple. Latoya continues to record as both a solo artist and a member of the hip-hop slash Europop act, Urban Punk. She also performed as part of an extended residency with the Carolina Opry. Number 8. Candace Raquel Glover Candace Glover won the 12th season of American Idol. Glover is the first winner to have auditioned three times before being cast for the live shows. Her debut album, Music Speaks, was released on February 18, 2014, along with her debut single, I Am Beautiful, which reached 33 on Billboard's Hot R&B slash Hip Hop songs. Glover made her Broadway debut in the show Home for the Holidays, Live on Broadway, which was presented in late 2017 at the August Wilson Theater. Number 7. Melinda Doolittle Melinda Doolittle finished as a third-place contestant on the sixth season of American Idol. Prior to her appearance, Doolittle worked as a professional backup singer for Kirk Franklin, BB and CC Winans, Vanessa Bell Armstrong, and others. Doolittle recorded her debut CD, Coming Back to You, in February 2009. In April 2010, she released her book, Beyond Me, finding your way to life's next level, detailing her life before, during, and after her American Idol experiences. Number 6. Kimberly Don Locke. Kimberly is an American singer, songwriter, and model. Prior to auditioning for American Idol, 24-year-old Kimberly was an administrative assistant at a company that licenses music for jukeboxes in Nashville, Tennessee. She had also just enrolled in law school. After leaving Curb Records in 2009, Kimberly became the first artist signed to Randy Jackson's new dance label, Dream Merchant 21. If you love our videos and have a suggestion for a future edition, let us hear from you in the comments section below. Number 5. Christopher Ruben Studdard Ruben Studdard rose to fame as winner of the second season of American Idol. During the televised competition, Ruben gained the nickname Velvet Teddy Bear. He earned a Grammy Award nomination in December 2003 for Best Male R&B Vocal Performance for Superstar. In the years following Idol, Studdard has released six studio albums, including his platinum-selling debut, Soulful, and the top-selling gospel follow-up, I Need an Angel. Number 4. Mandiza Lynn Hundley 
Mendeza Hunley placed ninth in September 5th of American Idol, but has received great success after the show. She released her debut studio album, True Beauty, in 2007, and it reached number one on the U.S. Christian chart. Mendeza has been nominated four times for a Grammy Award, and in 2014, Mendeza won a Grammy for Best Contemporary Christian Music Album for her gospel album, Overcomer. She was also nominated six times for Dove Awards. Mendeza's fifth full-length album, Out of the Dark, was released in May 2017. Number 3. Fantasia Taylor Barino Fantasia has had a strong music career since American Idol and has sold over 3 million records and won numerous awards and accolades. She released her debut album in 2004 that went on to become platinum certified and earned her three Grammy nominations. In 2011, Fantasia won her first Grammy Award for the Best Female R&B Vocal Performance for Bittersweet. She starred in a Lifetime movie about her life, was featured in her own reality show for VH1, and has performed in two Broadway shows, The Color Purple and After Midnight. Number 2. Jordan Brianna Sparks Jordan Sparks rose to fame in 2007 after winning the sixth season of American Idol at age 17, becoming the youngest winner in American Idol history. Her self-titled debut studio album, released later that year, was certified platinum and has sold over 2 million copies worldwide. Her No Air collaboration with Chris Brown is currently the third highest selling single by any American Idol contestant, and the song earned Sparks her first Grammy Award nomination. The young singer has embarked on a TV and movie acting career, launched a clothing line called Sparks, introduced the fragrance Because of You, and made her Broadway debut in 2010, appearing in the musical In the Heights. Number 1. Jennifer Kate Hudson Jennifer Hudson rose to fame in 2004 as a finalist on the third season of American Idol, coming in seventh place. As a singer, Hudson has released three studio albums. Her self-titled debut album, Jennifer Hudson, was released in 2008 and was nominated for four Grammy Awards, winning the 2009 Grammy Award for Best R&B Album. She became the principal singer of the Color Purple Musical Album, which earned her the 2017 Grammy Award for Best Musical Theater Album. As an actress, she made her film debut portraying Elfie White in Dreamgirls, for which she gained worldwide acclaim and won an Academy Award, a Golden Globe Award, a BAFTA Award, and a Screen Actors Guild Award for Best Supporting Actress. She has made numerous television appearances, and in 2015, she made her Broadway debut in the role of Shrug Avery on the revival of The Color Purple. In 2016, Hudson was announced as a coach of the 2017 series of The Voice UK, where she became the first female coach to win. The following year, Hudson was announced as a coach on the 13th season of The Voice US. She co-founded the Hudson King Foundation for Families of Slain Victims in honor of her mother, brother, and young nephew who were killed by their sister's estranged husband. We appreciate the fact that you stayed with us until the end. Thank you for spending time with us, and don't forget to like this video. Also, make sure you subscribe so that you never miss a video. Bye for now. We will see you tomorrow.